Hey guys, this week in the rundown, we're taking a look at the DOD's upcoming new retirement system, and there's an active duty fund drive that needs your contributions. Signed into law last November, the Fiscal Year 16 National Defense Authorization Act, or NDAA, created a new military retirement system for service members. The new blended retirement plan goes into effect January 1, 2018 and will modernize DOD's retirement system. For those of us serving today, don't worry, you will be grandfathered in the current system. For those who join after January 1, 2006, you will have the choice to enroll in the blended retirement system or keep the one you have now. However, those who join the Navy after January 1, 2018 will be automatically enrolled in the new retirement plan. The three parts of the blended retirement system will consist of automatic and matching contributions to TSP accounts, continuation pay after 12 years of service, and a pay annuity for those who complete 20 years of military service. Stay tuned for the force by training this summer, which will provide financial literacy training to help you make fiscal decisions like how much to pay to allocate to retirement savings accounts and where to invest it. To read more on the new system, you can visit militarypay.defense.gov. On their website, they have a graphic that you can download which breaks down how the new system will work and provides the effective dates. Finally, the Navy and Marine Corps Relief Society, or NMCRS, is conducting its annual active duty fund drive to help raise funds to benefit our shipmates and Marines. The campaign's theme this year is by our own, for our own. Your contributions will help the NMCRS continue to provide support for our service members in a time of need or during a crisis. Last year, the NMCRS provided relief for nearly 60,000 sailors and Marines and their families and provided more than $45 million in financial assistance. To give back or to find out more on the Relief Society, visit their website at www.nmcrs.org. You can also find more details on the active duty fund drive by reading NAVADMIN 027-16 on NPC. Well, that's all for this week. For any questions, you can send us a message at usnpeople at gmail.com. For the Chief of Naval Personnel, I'm MC2 LJ Burleson. Thanks for watching. <laughs>